Hey guys, I wanted to send you a video just to update you what's been happening since you sold the vote. So, all right, a couple things. One, this, someone through the years kept replacing the impeller, but the housing actually got clogged up and it just one time it gave me an overheat alarm. So I went and took it apart and it was clogged up. So I rebuilt this whole system in here, right? So that's done. And then back here, you can't see when, because now we have a trailer, right? And so this, I've, I've done some modifications to the trailer we got set up. And I've got some guides to get us on here. But my wife couldn't see where the engine is because of this. So I put a backup camera on the boat, all right? And this got whomped. So I've had this rebuilt. And if you remember, this was bent. This was completely folded over, and this hole wasn't here. Now, I got the boat with, with cavitation going on at 20 and a half miles an hour. Since I've had this little piece right here fixed, I was actually dragging an anchor in the water a little bit. I am now doing 23.9 GPS just by fixing that one little thing. Um, I put in sonar. I've completely rewired it. New steering cables. And now I'm chemically straightening this stuff out. Um, uh, this was pitted real bad. As you can see, it's getting there. This, I'm going to have to put some, uh, I think they call it gator glide across here. This is aluminum slag, according to the welder, and it'll never clean up. Uh, future things, I think I'm going to paint this thing a nice bright white, and I'm going to put metal fleck in it, and then we're going to pinstripe using the colors of the boat, which would be probably this blue and turn this, I think this used to be navy blue and I'll do a different setup to make it look a little more. I'm going for the retro look. Uh, let's see, I put on new navigation lights. These headlights are so bright. It's $36 on Amazon, but it's so bright it would it'd blow your mind, all right? I also, this is an automatic winch system. So you take, and that's what was dragging when I was testing the speed. So you just set this over the side as you get close and it's got a remote control up here on the helm and you hit drop, it drops it. And then it lets out another six, eight feet to get you at a, to get your anchor at this angle so that it pulls. All right, now you'll see that the seats, I've spent a lot of man hours on these seats. I've got these things clean looks like looks like a brand new boat I want you guys to see this so you know that I'm, I'm taking good care of her um, our next thing that we have planned to do one I've got a weak spot in here so I'm going to patch all this up and and up here I'm going to do some a waterproofing agent peel the carpet back do a waterproofing agent and then put it back down and then I'm going to move this this is that shut off the switch valve for the tanks we'll move that and then I'm gonna rebuild this into a different storage system because we use these containers. And if I can put those there, and then we're actually gonna turn that into a working bathroom. Uh, this is gonna be used as our kitchen. It's already got stuff in there. I hang up all of my vests. Um, this just helps me for safety inspections out here on the lake because they pull up and they see those and they kind of take off and go. Um, this is gonna be storage. I'm gonna redo this. And then here I ordered a carbon fiber panel for switches. You'll see I've already put on, this is a new navigation system. So this will have all new stuff. Oh yeah, new horn. So I got that dressed up. Here is, this is for seeing the engine when you're loading it onto the trailer. Um, everything else is going good. My next thing I'm not sure if I'm going to paint first, but I do want to clean up all this aluminum in here. I'm thinking about a carbon fiber or what's called a symphony lighting program. It'll go up under, underneath all the seats and it can look like traveling lights, kind of like a disco theme. And then uh, this thing has been a godsend, this cover here. And I think that's it. You'll see the carpets are nice and clean. So we're coming along. Um, this winter, I'm going to have these redone and then we're going to patch these for another season and have these done next winter. And then I'm going to change out that captain seat. I want to put something, I'm actually going to move it back about another six inches and put in a bigger captain seat. So 
I think that's about it. If you remember, that was almost black. So I've got that all nice and clean and done. All right. And I hope you all have a great day. Bye.